once again, YouTube, and welcome back to The Domain in accordance with Strandy42 because he's holding me at gunpoint. <laughs> now, uh, this is a really great video series, uh, which we just had a blast in the last episode. These are all 3D printed works from LS3D Printing. He's done Zeta Sky helmets, four ODST backpacks from Fireteam Raven, Arbiter heads, and even a Master Chief Sauron. We popped and swapped all these, and today we're continuing the pop and swap train with a new custom creator, a new 3D printer has entered the ring. Bah, bah, bah. This is Dougie Custom 3D Prints, and he has Hi, a Dougie. website, DougieCustoms.com. And uh, yeah, we've been in, uh, you know, communication for a while. I do want to apologize. This video has taken a while to come out. I wanted to do it right, and I wanted to wait for a time that Strandy and I could sit here with boxes of Halo figures and do proper pop and swaps. So without further ado, let's find out what's in this tiny package. But as Yoda once said, Size matters not. Now this box, everything is sealed inside, so we're actually just gonna have to rip into each one. I know a lot of the things that are already in here, we've already had a little sneak peek. Look what's poking out there. Oh ho ho! Hayabusa. Hayabusa! It's the Hayabusa, and we're gonna pop and swap that one right away. That's an old style figure, so it's not really made for it, so I'm actually not gonna force that. Let's try this one from Battle for the Ark. Ooh, you're looking good there, Hayabusa. Okay, Strandy, let's tear these open. Yeah, let's get them. What? Ooh, what's that? That is a kit bash. Mm. So it's one of the things that you would probably glue onto a hip or a shoulder pad. Ooh, Ooh. a belt. Oh. Okay, so that's my pop and swap figure, and this is a 3D printed version of my belt. Whoa. That is really cool. All right, pop and swap it, baby. All right. So Holy you can buy out. all of these on DougieCustom.com. He's updating it all the time. So at least, even if you don't want to buy any, just go check out the website, because there's so much interesting stuff on there. You can learn a lot about 3D printing. <laughs> and, ooh. Well, Strandy, you've obviously got to keep that one. Move baby. your hand so I can get it in focus. Thank you. I I appreciate well, that. Well, we got two. That's we got really two, dude. cool. I guess I can keep one too. Let's get some scissors on these because some of these are tightly wrapped. Uh, which one do you want to do, Strand? Ooh, I got a really cool one here right, right now. So we're going to do this. Oh my gosh. And I brought special figures for this one. Oh, <laughs> oh. No look at way, that. Dude. Oh, that's that is that's absurd. Dude. That's All right, absurd. the question is a red or a white on oh, regard? Uh, red. Red? No, white, actually. Yep, yeah, white. Yeah. That. Oh. No, you need the oh. head. <laughs> oh, you need the head. Oh, of course. So that's kind of cool. Oh, shit. Just so there's a little bit of a difference between uh, LS3 no and Dougie's. Way. Dougie actually <gasps> has Yo. a peg. That's kind of cool. Shut <laughs> up, dude. <laughs> it looks Shut so good. Up. Oh, my gosh. What is. Oh, my God. I can't. So, yo, yo, I did not realize they were four actual MCX Elite heads. That is That's nuts, dude. That is nuts. Oh, I've never seen something like that. That is wild. I think we have one other one somewhere here, too, so oh, that'll be fun. There's another oh. one. Oh, goodness me. Do we do two whites or one red? Two, uh, two whites, I think. Two whites, I think. Right. I guess the red as well. I, guess I mean, just to see well. what it looks like, just but, like, I mean, yeah. just for classic honor guard, now I'll let you do it. Oh, Damn. Absolutely Same. outrageous, dude. Absolutely outrageous. Ooh. Another Ooh. Hayabusa. Another Hayabusa? I guess Strandy's going home with a Hayabusa oh, as well. Oh, man. I don't know. I think it's fun. I think just mix it up because Hayabusa's just like... I know it's Halo 3, but... Whew, I don't know, dude. That's, that's, that's pretty, pretty good. That's pretty good. Oh, I love it. I love it. What's next, Strandy? What's next? I think we got some more uh, some more belts here. That wow. is pretty sweet. So that's just a nice, awesome Halo Reach belt piece. Now these ooh, ooh, they're are black? cool. So these are kit bash. So this is a specific for a, a hip attachment. It's a pouch. So mm. kit bash is where you glue things on. Yeah, right. So that's pretty sweet. Amazing. It just bulks out your figures. It just makes them feel even more meaty. Yep. Mega has talked about uh, 3D printing before and they've expressed not only do they feel like 3D printing is a natural extension of their brand. We think we should uh, have Kickstarter projects. They say, hey, you know, like production of pieces is uh, very difficult, like very expensive. If you want a CQB, donate to this project. And once we reach our donation limit, you know, will then uh, ship out a CQB helmet to everybody that donates it. Oh. Ooh. What are those? No! <laughs> no! The no. mad lad did it. Oh! <laughs> oh! Halo 3 rat. Halo 3 rat. It fits on ah! a peg. <laughs> <laughs> it fits on a stud. <laughs> no! 
fun fact, uh, today is the day that 343 has released massive mod support for mm. MCC. One of the things they specifically added was a Halo 3 rat boss fight in Halo Reach. Wait, you can do that? Wait, you a can- A massive wait, rat. Wait, 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 I can play that tonight? Look at these. Oh. Yo. <laughs> And uh, these are all these are all pretty affordable. Like the prices are good on all of these. You can get these uh, right now. Again, a Dougie custom. I think it's obvious which the standout beast in this one is. These little hip pouches. He does do in different colors. Nice, sweet, nice. The MCX community is eating so well at this present. We've moment. got some insane talent. LS 3D printing just went full time on his uh, his printing journey. It's so important to support your local 3D printer. There's something cool here. You're gonna want to see. No way, dude. <laughs> there's another one, there's another one right there. Bro, that's outrageously small, dude. That is that's crazy. Like, that's, that's like a couple of millimeters. I remember Kevin Hurd, Halo Collector, yeah. even like six or seven years ago, he messaged me and he was like, dude, 3D printing is going to be outrageous in the future. And dude, I believe him. This is the last packet. Let's get it open. This is going to be more kit bash. No, no that's right? another hit. I have brought one more thing to the table. Super glue. Gorilla glue. Why don't oh, we do a little gonna, bit of kit bashing? I'm going to put one of these knives on something. This is a process. Get it on quick. I think that's going to work. Give me just a tiny bit of tack. I will put it on, but there's too much high energy right now. Dougie, you have just low key straight up updated my figure significantly. Yeah. Look how good that fits. That's thigh armor. Ah, ah, I'm getting glue everywhere. Ah, oh no, it's everywhere. We lost, we lost it. I can't believe you've done this. It's very British Ow. of you. That hip attachment is on, and then we've got our little knife. That's our Dougie Customs Showcase. My goodness, oh me, my oh my, this is absolutely gorgeous. Absolutely I can't believe it. Absolutely incredible. I can't believe well, it. Well, there's an obvious winner here, right, Strandy? Yeah. There is an Dude. obvious winner, and that is clearly the Halo 3 rat. Oh, Look at those. I, I, my favorite part is that it fits on a on a on a stud. Yeah, a stud. No, that no, is no, insane. It's outrageous. It's outrageous. These elites are so freaking clean. Also, I'm pretty mm -hmm. happy with. Look at all. Thick, my boy. Is. Thank you very much for tuning in today. This was another video with the domain with Strandy42 and Dougie Customs. And just a big shout out to Dougie. Like, you were very patient with this video, and I hope we did you proud. Everybody, please go check out Dougie Customs and get yourself some of these. I mean, this elite is just a no brainer for any Halo fan. This is epic. It's also a great way to get hold of a Hayabusa because Mega has confirmed they don't have the license for this, so we'll never get a new articulation Hayabusa. So you can do it right now with Dougie Customs. This was a pretty hype upgrade. Yeah, that's to outrageous. The Halo 2 Battle Royale This, from this will be featured well. here pretty quickly on my Instagram. So shout out to y'all. You stay awesome. You stay safe out there, folks. And the Elite Brothers are signing off. What, what, what?